Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2017-18 Panini Prism Basketball. 10 box, blaster edition, random team number four from jazbeescasebreaks.com. One spot gets you two teams right here. And of course, we are Jason Tatum hunting as well as these guys too. Big thanks to these folks for getting in. One spot gets you two teams, so let's double you up. All 30 NBA teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Six and a four, ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and tenth and final time. After ten times, we got Liam down to Jared. Six and a four, ten times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. After ten times, Bucks down to Hawks. All right, so Liam with the Milwaukee Bucks, Bill with the Trailblazers, Nicholas with the Knicks, Brian O with the Sixers, Darren with the Thunder, Chance with the Suns, Rick with the Mavs, Scott with the Cavs, Darren with the Raptors, Tony with the Bulls, Stacy with the Clippers, Chance, you have the Boston Celtics, Brian O with the Heat, Ricky with the Wizards, Tony with the Pacers, Ricky with the Pelicans, Rick with the Warriors. Matthew, you have my Lakers and the Timberwolves, Cody with the Jazz, Liam with the Spurs, Stacy with the Rockets, Nicholas with the Magic, Liam uh, with your last spot, Mojos, Nuggets, and Hornets, Jared with the Grizz, Cody with the Kings, Scott with the Pistons, Bill with the Nets, and Jared with the Atlanta Hawks. Let's sort this by team. And we'll pause the video and allow for a little bit of trade chatter. And when we come back, we'll have the break. And we've got Brooklyn at Boston right now, Celtics leading 99-88, and my Lakers going to be playing in a little bit as well. Be right back. All right, welcome back, folks. No trade here on the 3rd of March. It's March already. Random team number four, 10 box, half case blaster, 1718 Prism Basketball. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. This is part of tonight's promo. So if we do all, the, if we fill all the requisite breaks, you will be involved. I think there's only one final tonight in the NBA. It looks like Spurs edged out the Hornets 103, 104-103. I think all the other games are like in progress. Some of them are not even at halftime. I think the closest one to finishing might be this uh, might be the Nets at Celtics, and Celtics looks like they're pulling away. A couple minutes left in the fourth quarter, they're up 104-97. Couple fourth quarters just started. Clippers at Thunder. Clippers up 89-70. Start of the fourth quarter. It's like fourth quarter in New Orleans just started. Pelicans up 115 to 113. Timberwolves keeping it close. What else do we have? And then a couple games. Just a handful of minutes left until the first half is over. Warriors in Denver tied at 40. 6.36 left in the half, first half. Suns up 54.40 on the Raptors. Almost seven minutes left in the first half. My Lakers coming up. They're hosting the 76ers tonight. And then the other game that's going to start soon, Wizards at Sacramento. All right. With Michael Kidd Gil Gilcrest. These greens are not numbered, by the way, just FYI. And there's Will Barton for the Denver Nuggets. Trendsetter, are we doing that break credit promo tonight? I hope so. I sure hope so. We're close. So it's definitely doable. 
asks whether people want to do it or not. Surely people won't leave $1,000 of break credit on the table. Details on jaspiescasebreaks.com. Luke Nard Green, Earl Watson, coach. And there's Jason Tatum, relic. That'll be for Chance. That's Jason Tatum taking, taking the night off. And there's his new teammate, Kemba Walker, right there, too. Somehow, Panini and you. Oh, yeah, Bam Adebayo is a rookie in this one, too. Ben Simmons, a year after his rookie year. All right, that Bam Adebayo will go to Brian O and the Miami Heat. Next couple. Mothra is saying the game won't be over until 1 a.m. on the East Coast. Sure, you can stay up. You can stay up that late. Just put on a pot of coffee. I think one summer, when my buddy was getting married. He was the wedding was in Brooklyn, in the summer, and I was there. I was during the baseball season, summer obviously. And the Dodgers were still in LA, and I remember getting a notification on my phone saying the Dodgers game just started, and I was like, "Wait, what?" And I was all discombobulated because at the time I was like, "That's." It's 10 o'clock here on the West Coast, or on the East Coast, 10 p.m. local time, but the Dodgers aren't starting until, so I was just like, I couldn't live on the East Coast. Couldn't do it. All right, exactly, Mothra. I was like, I can't do that. I, I couldn't do it either on the regular. If I could have to stay up until 1 a.m., no, I can't do that. An extra innings, forget about it. Although, if I do, if I work the same hours here, and if that just translates to the East Coast, I suppose I could do it. But a regular job, regular nine to five or whatever. Can't watch baseball until one a.m. I know, yeah. Calvin, Calvin is a West Coaster going to college on East Coast time. That's got to be terrible. Terrible. All right, it's too late. Way too late. There's Deer and Fox autograph. Nice. Sacramento Kings, Cody Passmore. There you go, Cody. Nice, a fox in the box. It's Markel Fultz, rookie. I still believe that Markel Fultz has a chance in becoming maybe, maybe a good redemption story for him. Kind of like Victor Oladipo style. I mean, he's the former number one overall pick. At some point, it's got to show out, right? Brian O with the 76ers, still Philadelphia edition. Kevin Love, Juwan Evans. Kevin Love for the Cavs, that goes to Scott. These are the green pulsars that are to 25.
And there's Lonzo Ball. That's true, DeLeo, on the flip side. Yeah. We got to wake up way too early if we want to do anything with with the stock market. Yeah, you wake up. And we're like, oh. The trading day's half over. Although, oh, there's some Jason Tatum right here. Just a regular one, though. Not a, not a silver. That goes to chance. Although Leo, it's not like it's not like I'd be it's not like I'd be moving markets with my trades, so <laughs> I think I'll be okay. There's Luke Kennard, relic for the Pistons, Scott Eckert with Motor City. Wow, the PSA 10s of the regular Jason Tatums are going for 200. What about what are they going for a raw? Like 100 bucks then? That's crazy. Yeah, the silvers I know are are, are doing really well on the secondary market, but DJ Wilson silver and then Steph Curry. Who I think is trying to make a comeback soon. Is it tonight? No, I don't think they're playing tonight. Or no, they are playing tonight. I don't think he's playing tonight. I mean, not that they need to rush him back, but... No, he's not, sorry. But he's trying to come back soon. This is DJ Wilson. That's for Liam and the Bucks. DJ Wilson Silver. All right, next handful of boxes here. those KB, those Kobe Bryant pins that the announcers are wearing here. I know they I know that they were they were part of a a swag package at the Kobe Memorial and all the money went to the all the proceeds went to the families of the of the crash. But I don't want to I don't want to get one on a secondary market with people trying to make money off of that. I don't want to do that. I'd like to donate somewhere. Maybe get one of those get one of those pins. And as far as I know, as far I know, as far as I know, the Academy site and the uh, Mamba on Three site, they don't have any of the any of that available at the moment. All right, next handful of boxes here. This is uh, Random Team Number Four, 2017-18 Panini Prism Basketball. Half of, of, of a uh, blaster case, these blaster editions. I want to switch back really quick to this Nets game. They're keeping it close. It's like with 6.7 seconds left. Celtics are only up by three, 118 to 115 on Brooklyn, but I don't know who has the ball, who has possession.
Oh, Celtics ball, says Kelvin. Yep, Celtics ball. Hmm, a Brooklyn stop could be interesting here. I think Celtics... What happened there? Oh, inbounded and timeout? Commercial. Celtics called a timeout. Good luck, everybody. This is Jamal Murray, Jeremy Lin, Pop, and Frank Tilakina, New York Knicks. That's going to go to Nick Casper. Nick and the Knicks. Giannis Antetokounmpo, Silver, Jared Allen. Save those. I like those guys. And there's Carl Anthony Towns, Matt Silverstein, with the Timberwolves. Ooh. Jump ball. Wow. Good play by Rodion's Kurix. Dust off your Rodion's Kurix rookie autos. And that play. So jump ball, center court. So what was the line on the Celtics? Must have been like minus like seven or something like that on this, right? Maybe more? Double digits maybe? No, minus six and a half. I like Kuz right there. And we got Terrence Ferguson. Terrence Ferguson relic for OKC. Darren McKenzie. Now Nets take a time. Don't look now, though, ladies and gentlemen, about these Nets. They've actually been playing a little bit better without Kyrie. Without Kyrie in the lineup. Although I don't think Kyrie's played enough this season to really kind of get that team to really to gel. But just an interesting storyline. And with, without Kyrie, they seem to be playing more like a, a team unit, keeping games close. But how does that change when both Kyrie and Kevin Durant are on that team? But if they could figure out how to make that work, Nets are going to be a kind of a scary team next year. If they can get Kyrie and KD, I mean, those two are probably going to work. But who are, who's going to be around those guys? If they can figure that out early, that's going to be a really interesting team. There's Blake Griffin. Scott with the Pistons. Yeah, Durant, I think Durant's shooting already, right? Can't really run around, but I guess he can just... Still got his upper body. He can still, still shoot. Imagine if Kevin Durant like improves his jump shot. <laughs> I mean, that's scary. Grant Hill, Relic. Pistons edition, going to Scott. All right, I stalled enough to, to get the end of this game here on the video. Nets inbounding 1.4. They got one, sh basically catch and shoot. Shoot, foul. Karis LeVert draws a foul behind the three point line. 0. 0.2 seconds left. Chris Paul playing some great basketball too. This is Rockets edition. Wow. Karis LeVert goes up. These are three huge... Are they not... Yeah, they're not reviewing it, Kelvin.
Karis LeVert hits the first one. Malik Monk, silver. Karis LeVert, two, second of three, makes it. And that was your break, ladies and gentlemen. Keep an eye out on jazbeescasebreaks.com for more hoops. Maybe that flawless basketball tonight. Karis LeVert. Wow, ties it. There you go. Looks like OT. No, they can't shoot. They don't have time to shoot it. Going to overtime. All right, folks. Well, maybe we'll see you for that. Check, check the ESPNNBA.com. I'm sure you'll see what the final score is. We'll see you next time, jazbeescasebreaks.com.